got it. We got it. <laughs> I'm Erisy. And I'm Eloise. And today we have another iteration of my husbando, okay. aka Roy Mustang. <laughs> we're just like, we got this. I know, we're, we're like, on mm, point. So, mm. like a couple videos ago, we did a review of the scale, the Kotobukiya scale mm -hmm. of Roy. And today, we have this little chibi-fied version. His we little Nindo. He's out of the box, but yeah. this is the box, and his he's over here. His in cutie little self pieces. is. You'll see more right of him there. later. Yes, but what's really interesting, what we wanted to point out right away, because oh, yeah, what stood ahead. out is the box is a much different size. Like this is Mikasa's box. This is just a random example. Yeah, this is kind of the standard size. Like it's much more compact. Yeah, it's much shorter. It's much like smaller, but it's wider on the side. Is it? Isn't that much wider? By a little bit. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, yeah. So I I don't know what sort of packaging revamping they did, but this is kind of neat. This I is, like it. Yeah, I mean less shipping costs, so I'm not yeah, complaining smaller, there. It's easier to store too because yeah. So this is really interesting. I don't know because this is the only like really recent Nendo I've gotten. I don't mm -hmm. know if this is the standard. You guys can tell us, but this is kind of interesting. Yeah. If this is what they're changing things to because this is very. Well, I can say I wish that my Nendo's like had that box because I constantly run into the pile of them and knock them over and then I scream about it because <laughs> I'm, I'm restacking my boxes all the time. Yeah, they do get in the way. So this is really nice that this is the new thing. But anyway, so we're gonna show you his bits and bops and show you some poses and review them for you guys. Yeah. Okay. Guys, here we have our close-up shot of the adorable Roy Mustang Nindo. He is so freaking cute. <laughs> I mean, come on guys. He's adorable. I just always think it's super entertaining, especially when there's like these serious badass characters that are like tiny and so cute and squishy. Just, I love Nendroids so much. They're so adorable. He's adorable and like he's got such great detail on his little gloves. And his face plates are really cool, and his hair looks perfect, of course. Uh, this is one of the super poseable Nendos, so his arms actually move at the elbow. You could also turn around his hands and um, his legs move like normal Nendos, but there's just a lot of posability that's really easy to do and like easy to move around, which is really nice. Yeah, he's kind he's of like, like the Genos one I have. Yeah, and he's just got these great little joints and details that you can see in there. And I think, yeah, Genos does all the same posing because they're like that super movable line. Which is really fun and really nice. I think it's a kind of cool option for some of their Nendos. And I think that it's good that they're doing more and more of those type of figures because then you don't have to fudge around with the arm pieces as much. And oh gosh, yeah. Mess around with that crap, so. <laughs> so <laughs> often good. with Nendos, they can be so hard to pose because it's just like, all right. I've got to balance it and then get his leg in this position and they fall over and everything falls off and you're like, all right, I guess I'm starting again. That's fine. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so he has this, this face plate and then he also has this serious, the angry face. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to set your ass on fire face. We said it's a skosh below something happened to Reza face. <laughs> exactly. Just a skosh. <laughs> and this is Edward, I'm mocking you because you're a fuck, but it's fine. Or screaming about mini skirts, you know. Yeah, mini skirts! <laughs> So, pretty cute, and of course he has the one he uh, has right now, which is his right. just sort of general one. He also has this really cool fire detail that can go around his legs, just if you want a circle of flames to be a badass. Yes. Which is really cool. It kind of mocks the uh, the big figure of him, too, because yeah. he's got the circle of flames. Yeah, so it's really cool that I can have or him. mimics, not mocks, but yeah, anyway. We get it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's like, it's cool that he can have the cool ring of flames, and then the big yes. one can have the ring of flames. He also, in the same vein, has this really cool flowy jacket that can go behind him, and it actually moves a lot itself, so you can yeah. adjust it to make sure you get the full effect of what you want going on. So if you wanted to be like a super dramatic bitch like he is, then he can have his jacket flying out behind him. <laughs> 
<laughs> exactly, full epicness. <laughs> There's also this detail that wraps around his arm if you want to have him snapping his fingers and you know setting the flames towards you to set you on fire. Mm -hmm. Very necessary for his character. And then he just has various um, hands and arm pieces. He can cross his arms for the one kind of shitty and grin expression that he has. And he also has um, gloved hands and non-gloved hands, depending on what you want to do. Yeah, it's kind of like general Nindo accessories. Like, there's a few extra hands, some extra arms, like a neck joint and stuff. The yeah. general stuff that every Nindo comes with. Yeah, but in general, I think it comes with a good amount of things. Mm -hmm. I mean, kind of everything that sums up Roy's character, I think. Which yeah, is definitely. just being a badass and setting you on fire. I mean, that's pretty much the core of his character. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of sums up Roy Mustang right there. So yeah, I think he's really wonderful, and I think this is perfect for anyone that's a fan of the character character of the series. He's really a great little Nendo. Yeah, he's super cute and we're excited that we will have Arisa to review when she's released. Yes! Risa is on her way uh, and that's Miss great. Miss Arisi's girlfriend is getting Risa, which is we're just we're all excited about. We can't split up the ship. The ship needs to be yes, together. Yes, they have to be together because <laughs> we said nothing comes above Risa when it comes yes. to Roy. <laughs> Best girl, waifu for laifu. <laughs> Alright guys, that kind of wraps up our review of our adorable or her adorable Nindo because he's super cute. In conclusion, Roy is still best boy mm -hmm. and he is gorgeous and this Nindo is perfect for any fans of the character or the show or any of that yes. I love these Full Metal Alchemist Nendos. I keep, I hope they keep making like everybody because I'll literally buy everybody because they're Didn't all great. Emily also get Al. Yeah, Emily, my girlfriend, has um, the Ed and the Al, so we might mm -hmm. be reviewing mm -hmm. Ed sometime on our channel too. We should. Cause well, we're doing the whole line at this point. Let's just do them all. all. Go do for them it. all. <laughs> also, just a quick side note, this will be our new backdrop as Erisi is moved. Yes, this is the new room. We'll have to show you around sometime, mm -hmm. but yeah. It's very nice. Yeah. All right, guys, it's going to... Close it off for now, and we'll see you next time. Like, comment, subscribe, and all that jazz, and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.